guys, Miss Jamie here. Um, I was just sitting down in my basement and um, thought maybe I'd make like a little public service announcement. I don't know if any of you guys um, have seasonal affective disorder or SAD, and that is um, when you have, you know, in the winter you just feel depressed. And some people they just feel kind of blue or down a little bit, but other people, I mean, you can feel really depressed. I mean, just awful, where it affects you getting up out of bed or maybe just enjoying doing things that you usually enjoy. Um, it, it used to hit me really, really hard. And it's just because, you know, there's not as much sunlight uh, here in the northern Midwest and you are um, further away from the sun. So even if you are out getting sun, you're not getting the... Um, benefits from being out in the sun other than hey there's the sun um, <clears throat> what you'll have to forgive me I'm getting over a cold um, one thing I found like uh, six or seven years ago when it was really really bad for me um, I thought I finally broke down and I bought a what they call a sad light a seasonal affective disorder light it can also help with uh, sleep problems like getting to sleep earlier um, jet lag supposedly <clears throat> um, it can help with um, anyhow I bought one and I started using it and within like within the third or fourth day I couldn't believe the difference that it made. It was like I was getting up in the morning and even though it was still dark outside, I felt like it was light outside. Like because our bathroom doesn't have a window or anything. So I go in the hallway and go in the bathroom and I just have that feeling like it's daytime. But I can't explain it. I just felt like a definite change within my thought patterns, I guess. Anyhow, our thought process is my thoughts, my mind. Um, so, I, I don't know, and it has really, really helped with um, just the overwhelming sadness I get and just not wanting to do anything. I mean, I get stuff done, but it's like, I don't want to go out of the house. I don't want to do anything. I just want to sit and cry. That's sad. Um, <laughs> um so anyhow, yeah, I start using my sad light. That's the light that I'm sitting under now. Um, I start using my sad light in maybe like late October, early to mid-November. And then I try to use it every day for just a, about 20 minutes to a half an hour. Sometimes if I'm looking at stuff on YouTube, watching YouTube videos, I may stand up for an hour by accident. No harm. Um, but yeah, if, if this is something that bothers you, if you do get... Um, depressed in the winter or just really sad or you just, you know, you feel good in the summer but then you're just like, ooh, in the winter go ahead and check it out. I'm no doctor um, I'm not going to give any more advice or tell you much more about it, but just look up seasonal affective disorder or sad and then um, look up sad lights I bought this one off of uh, Amazon and there are a million different lights, so you want to look up, like online, what the best sad lights are, if you're interested in one. But, um, all I can say is it's really helped me, and it's helped a few other people that I've recommended it to. Um, there are some sad lights that are really expensive. My, actually, I'll show you what this sad light looks like. Do, 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 do. So you get to see my washer and dryer. So, maybe it's too bright, but this is my sad light on a little stand. I put it on a bucket. Who knows what that, it may have just all been white. I don't know. I might try and edit. Oh, I might try and edit and then just put a picture of it in or something when the light is off. But um, the first one I started out was only about a little bit bigger than a, a book, you know, smaller than a Bible, uh, your good old Bible. It was about this big and maybe about that thick. And it was a travel light. And uh, I knew it was going to happen. <laughs> And so that's the one I used, and that's the one that I got um, most benefit from. I had to lay in bed and kind of hold it, so I was switching arms for 20 minutes, because you can't just hold your arm like this for 20 minutes. But um, then I got this one just so I could, like, read a book or look at my phone or do whatever, and I wouldn't have to hold it. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so anyhow, uh, sorry to ramble, but I just thought if it would even help one person, I wish someone would have told me about it like 25, 30 years ago, that would have been a lifesaver. Um, 
So I thought, hey, I'm sitting here looking at my phone. Why not make a video? Anyhow, I hope you guys have a great morning, great afternoon, great after after evening. Have a great after evening and have a great evening and great night. And um, I hope you enjoy your day. My laundry's getting ready to finish here. I'll swap it over to the dryer. I'll see you guys later. Bye.